Uh, yeah, what's your question? Is Corey the say could the dreams or is break the dreams or is destroy the dreams? Because I write in could the dreams, but dreams. Correct? Dreams. Dreams? That's when dreams. You yeah. Yes. Uh -huh. But what is the correct for the say? What what do you because want to I say? Okay. What's your what's the sentence you want to say? Because I'll I'll draw I'll draw it complete is Colombia has been at was for more that uh, five years um okay the <laughs> the short part is the same uh, the soci the soci socialist that other could their dreams but is correct the same could you do you have a screen you could share with us on on your what you've written uh-huh pulled it up okay, i can't see that <laughs> so something about dreams being uh being crushed is that right so dreams uh dreams being sort of something about continue talking about it what what is it <laughs> the complete tense the complete what uh, what's what I didn't quite hear what you wanted to say. I'm writing the could the sociality the social could the dreams on the younger person person. So could you type could you type in the box on the right uh, part? I'm, I'm, I can't know see it or not see it. I don't know. But I wait, I think that I, you want to see wait 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 the society. The society. So the society. Yes. The society is called the dreams. But it's cute. The dream. It's so but again. It's cut, it's break, or or is destroyed. <laughs> we'll just just pause a second. If we look at that, the society. Can you see that this is the same uh, sort of grammar rule as we we had before with education and also um, uh, people or the life that was it so if we have a um, an abstract noun like society life or education we can only use uh, a definite article if we are making it into a relative clause or we are relating it to a particular case. Um, so I'll write that out here. We can only use definite article the when it uh, relates to a particular society, life or education. Um, so we have to, or that's perhaps something that a lot of you will find in uh, where you've written a, a similar mistake coming up again. Um, it's a very common one because uh, in Spanish you say la sociedad, la vida, la educación. But we, um, in English this changes and the abstract nouns don't have a, a definite or indefinite article unless you are saying the society of the society of um, uh, Buenaventura, okay? This is or the society of Bucaramanga, and we're talking about a specific society. Only then do we need that article, okay? All clear? Yes, yes. Thank you. Yes, yes, I understand. And the rest of your sentence was so society has um I'm I'm not quite hearing you. Your microphone might have a, a problem. 
Who? Me? Speak again. Tell me. Help that again, please. Uh, I think the, the, the sentence was the society. No, society. Society. Uh -huh. uh, the dreams or or have been killed. The dreams. I don't know. Something like society has killed. Uh, the dreams. Of something like that. This society has killed the dreams of who? Who are you talking about? Whose dreams? <laughs> I I understand the young, the young, the five uh, now. Ah, uh, the youth, uh, youth. So society has killed. It's a bit dramatic. <laughs> um, perhaps <laughs> society has killed the dreams um, of. Uh, of the of youth, or the youth. Um, let's kill things, of, or of young people, we'd say. Young, young people. There we go. I might even say society. This often goes together. Society has crushed the dreams, or it has crushed young people's dreams. <laughs> But again, it's it's a little bit dramatic, and I'm not sure what your what the context is of your uh, essay. <laughs>